What's something you wish you could experience the way men do? I wish I could experience having a fast food job as a man. Customers wouldn't try to make small talk with me as often and would instead just get what they need from me and go. My job does make it blatantly obvious that many customers just prefer the young female workers. My job is giving them what they paid for which is food. Not getting to chat with a girl. I appreciate people who are nice but I'm not always feeling social. I accept people wanting to chit chat when I'm a cashier. I do see that as part of the job if I'm taking orders. Not when I'm the food runner and have 20 other meals to serve people. It would be so nice to not be expected to be everybody's mother. If I'm not sweet and nice. I'm judged so much harder for it than any man would ever be. Even if I'm not being rude. Just not being over the top caring and helpful. It would be so nice to not be the first person everyone else. Even total strangers. Turns to for comfort or help because hey. I'm a woman over 30 so I'm basically mommy. Right? And then if I don't play along and mother them the way they want I'm mean and bitter and a B word. And a Karen and how dare I. I want to be able to pee standing up. Especially when in the wilderness in inclement conditions. Imagine not having to expose my whole undercarriage to 30. Or to all the black flies in bug season. Jealous. Having medical professionals take my experience and pain seriously the first time. I just want the strength. The other day my partner and I had a 300 plus pound patient to move and I had to flatter. A young male EMT in the hallway to come help us I thanked him profusely. And. I go to the gym. I lift weights. But this kid was so much stronger than me that it put me to shame and he wasn't a huge buff gym rat. Type guy. Just an ordinary looking 22 year old dude. The ease to lift patients. Move heavy stuff. Etc. I am not ashamed to say I burn with envy. To have walked down the street in my 20s holding my three year old's hand without people driving past. And shouting get your tits out or sit on my face. Then having your three-year-old ask you what that means. Or. To have been able to walk to the bus stop in my school uniform when I was 14 without men driving. Past peeping their horns and shouting things out the windows. Men really are pigs. My work only being seen for my intelligence. Quality. And creativity the way men's creative work is seen. I bet being a male artist is amazing. People would just genuinely appreciate your intelligence and even your character wouldn't matter. Also the way men are allowed to be funny make jokes. I'd love to experience how men are allowed to just be goofy and funny and people find it endearing. Funny. Driving my car. My husband and I share a Hellcat basically a race car that we bought together and pay for equally. Yet he gets treated so differently when he drives versus when I drive. When he drives people say awesome car. Etc. When I drive even when I'm alone people say your husband has an awesome car. One time a man even asked me what my monthly allowance is from my husband. Being able to walk alone at night without significant danger. I would love to be able to go on a nice stroll at night when the air gets cooler and it's less busy. I know I wouldn't be perfectly safe as a man. But as a woman. It almost seems like every area I go to at night has me on edge constantly. Not being hounded when I say that I don't want children. When a man says it is respected because he wants to be better for himself. When a woman says it is taken with such animosity. Intercourse orgasm. And how when I'm satisfied, sex is done. To not be judged and criticized for having sex and enjoying sex.
to have my sexual needs validated instead of being considered obscene and horrible by society. This is such a privilege that men have that they take for granted. They still complain about not getting enough sex but they don't get how lucky they are to allowed to have sex. The entire world being taught to sympathize with every iteration and variation of me as a person. Through media, movies, games, being seen as a complex, nuanced person rather than just one of four types, or an object to win a prize from, or a thing to be caught. I wish I could experience small talk with the opposite sex as a man. No uneasy feeling that this person is going to ask me out and then verbally abuse me for saying no. At the end of the conversation. Comfortable clothes that are functional, affordable, true to size and long-lasting. Family life. Having someone to do all the mental load. All the domestic work. Getting up during the night early mornings with children. All the organizing etc etc I'd love to get up. Work. Eat my dinner and relax instead I get up. Get the children up. Get them breakfast. Make their lunches. Do their hair. Get him to school on time. Then go to work. Come home. Cook dinner. Load the dishwasher. Put a wash on. Clean the kitchen. Do bedtime. Answer 101 calls for bedtime delays. Hang washing out and then relax. I just want to be able to hike anywhere alone or go for a walk after 8 p.m. Parenthood. The drop-off. Sick days. Pickups. DRS appointment. A holiday I want a day where I'm the daddy. Being able to nap on a plane next to a stranger without worrying about being groped. I want to be able to exist without being objectified constantly. Oh and be hairy without being shamed for it. Being asked if I'm upset if I'm not smiling and being told to smile. I'm not a doll with a permanent grin plastered on my face. Kindly fuck off. Doing the bare minimum and completely and totally getting away with it. Hell. Even getting promoted while everyone else works their asses off. I wanna be the asshole that fails up for once. It would be nice to be able to reliably have an orgasm in almost every sexual encounter. Regardless of what's going on. Without having to issue basic instructions on how my anatomy works and where the fun zone actually is. Going to the doctor. Just once it would be nice to show up. Describe symptoms. Be believed. And immediately get offered testing scans etc. Rather than having to beg for it after being told I'm over dramatic when I scream in pain while a Doctor jams a needle directly into the tip of my finger I just cut off with zero numbing whatsoever. I wonder how different my career in tech would have gone if I were a man. No stalking. Harassment from managers and peers that want to fuck me or belittle me. Dealing with managers not looking me in the eye. Being able to feel camaraderie. Acceptance. Myself represented. Not being questioned in anything I do or say because I am a woman. Would I have claimed promotion sooner? Seen as more brilliant? Being an asshole at work. Not being challenged on everything I say. Being able to just be indifferent. Not care and still get what you want a lot of the time. Simply the confidence that comes with existing even just a mediocre white man due to the way society as a whole lifts up and praises white men in just about every area. Peeing outside when hiking or camping. Walking around without being terrified of male sexual assault. Life. Walking. Shopping. Working. Career. Living alone. All of it. As long as I could be a white man in the US. I'd be free.